Good morning, everybody. Don't worry, I have got my coffee. I know that it may look a little bit dark outside. I don't know if you can see through the blinds, but um, that's because I am in London and it doesn't get light until like 8 a.m. or something ridiculous. Okay, let's get started. So I'm gonna talk to you all about something that I am very passionate about, and that is videos for powerful ad campaigns. Now, I'm a video producer, so I know how important marketing videos are. I have had the pleasure of working with many really interesting brands on a lot of different projects. And I remember the one that made the biggest impact was a brand called Cobox. You might have seen them around London and we created a video for them and it resulted in 10 times their ROI in membership sales which means they made 10 times the amount that they had put into this ad campaign. So the real question, why are marketing videos so important? Well, that's because videos engage even the laziest of buyers. The modern customer wants to see the product in action. Video marketing can capture a wide audience and it works on so many levels. For example, an explainer video where you can explain exactly what your product does or a video showing all of the ways that you can use the product or just showing off the product at all of its best angles. Hey guys. Hello. Like putting a dog in a video. But how do you know which videos are gonna market well? Well, that is so easy nowadays. There are so many tools that you can use to find which videos are doing really well, which videos are getting a lot of engagement. And this is a little tip as well if you're looking for product. So let's search for the videos that are doing the best in your niche using AdSpy. That gives me a pretty clear idea of what I need to do next. Before we get started actually creating these videos, let's take a look at the finer details. So what sizes and lengths do you need these videos to be? So as you probably saw from my previous video, I use Salesforce to download any video footage or images of my product from AliExpress. And now I can use these videos and images to create my own video. A lot of people ask, are AliExpress photos and videos copyrighted? Uh, you can actually see here that you're more than welcome to use the photos and videos that are shown on AliExpress. The Photos and videos used on their platform are open source images, so you don't need to worry about copyright issues by using the photos and videos they provide. I feel like in all my videos, I'm using the word tools so much, tools, tools, tools. So there are so many tools now that you can use that make making videos so much easier than they were. Um, so you don't need to be an Adobe Pro to make a marketing video. Actually, maybe it's easier to use a tool like InVideo or Animoto, which I'm gonna show you how they work, to create your video because they already have templates, which means that you can make your promo video in minutes rather than wasting hours and hours trying to figure out how to use Adobe, how to create transitions, um, where to get music from and all of that. You know, you might as well just use a ready-made template from one of these tools. As we're gonna look at in video, all of the tools I'm gonna use have either a free trial or a free version so that it's accessible for everybody. I'm not expecting you guys to go and spend money on your videos just yet. I'm gonna use the free trial of in video. There is also a free version, but why not check out the free trial to make your first video? You can also spend $29 a month on in video. Um, but you don't need to do this. And then I'm gonna compare it to Animoto, which is a completely free video creating software. Whilst I'm comparing these two, I've also put an ad on Fiverr for somebody to create my video themselves. 
So I'm gonna walk you through this and then we're gonna compare all three. Is it better to use a partly paid software? Is it better to use a free software or is it better to outsource it and pay somebody to do it? Let's see which one gets the best result. First up is NVIDIA. Okay, so I'm gonna get started here with the free trial and just put in all of my details. So you can see there are already so many different templates to choose from. Um, we have the ratios. I'm gonna start with the 16 by nine and then move on to one by one later on. Now I need my um, script. So I'm gonna use sales source again to find my competitors and see the taglines and everything that they've been able to use. And I'm gonna use this to build my script. I'll use this for my title. I couldn't see anything on AliExpress, but you can see how easy it is here to go onto other people's websites who are selling the same thing. Okay, now let's build the video. Obviously these images didn't work. Um, I'm gonna go to my folder where I downloaded all the images and video. Also going to try and use some of their stock images and I'm going to see what I can do um, with both the stock images and my images combined. So all of their stock images are free. So here you can see you can upgrade for free. Uh, you can don download the video with the watermark for free. Um, and I think that they've done a really good job, to be honest. I'm quite happy with this video. Um, obviously, if I spent more time on it, it could be better, but I'm quite happy with this one. Yay, okay, now next, let's jump into Animoto. Um, you can see that this video turned out really well. It's pretty cool. Um, it's really engaging. And now I'm going to create my next video using Animoto. Again, I'm going to set up my free account. Um, so this is really quick and easy to do. Um, okay, so business. And I'm just going to choose from one of these templates. This one looks the best to me so far. Um, cool. So I think that you can choose this in different ratios. 
there we go so now i'm just going to change my title and then i'm going to upload the videos and images to this folder i'll also copy the script from the previous video Um, so there's not so many options for animation and stuff on the images here. It seems a little rigid, but um, I, I think we could still do something cool. Okay, add my logo in here. Okay, I don't like it as much as in video. I mean, it still does something, but let's try it in the square ratio. Okay, it does look better like this, right? It looks better in the square. Um, cool, but we can compare them after this. I'd also like to add that it's a bit annoying that they only tell you that you have to pay to remove the watermark at the end after all of your hard work. Um, so that's another reason why I think NVIDIA is a little bit more transparent. Ah, this is getting exciting. So I'm going to show you both videos side by side and I want you guys to comment below for NVIDIA or do you prefer Animoto? Let's check them out. Now I'm gonna walk you through how I found somebody on Fiverr, exactly how much it costs. Um, we're gonna look at the time frame that I got my video back in. And is it actually better than the other two videos that I've just created for basically free? Okay, I finally got my video back in under 24 hours and I am really excited to see what it looks like. Yes, this video cost me five pounds to make. Uh, that's pretty, pretty amazing. But now I'm gonna look at all three videos and decide which one I think is the best. Hmm, really, really difficult to choose. But I would have to say I'm leaning a little bit towards the in video. But let's not leave it there. Why don't we test this against ads? Um, I'm gonna release a video um, and I'll let you know which video was the highest converting out of the three. Make sure you subscribe to keep an eye out for theirs and like this video if it helped you out. I also want you all to drop in the comments below which video you liked the best. If you guys used any of these tools to create your own videos, drop a link below. I would love to see what you have all created and I will see you back here next time. See ya.